हेलो ऑल आई एम डॉक्टर नितिन जैन आई एम प्रैक्टिसिंग एज गैस्ट्रो इंटेस्टिनल हिपेटोबिलेरियन लैप्रोस्कोपिक सर्जन इन मुंबई सिंस लास्ट सेवनटीन ईयर्स आई एम वर्किंग इन मेनी कॉर्पोरेट हॉस्पिटल्स इन मुंबई एंड आई हैव माय ओन क्लिनिक इन पवई टुडे आई एम गोइंग टू टॉक अबाउट गॉल बैडर स्टोन वेरी कॉमन प्रॉब्लम ऑल ओवर वर्ल्ड एवरी वन मस्ट हैव हर्ड और एक्सपीरियंस गॉल बैडर स्टोन पेशेंट in and around their family friends somewhere but still there are many doubts myths about gallbladder stones when someone should get operated when someone should not get operated and if you see sonography of many people most of the times 20 to 30% of the people you will have some gallbladder stones and then the real question comes does everyone requires operation no i don't think so all patients do not require operation for gall bladder stones but that does not mean no one should get operated in spite of having gall bladder stones so it is a balanced decision which needs to be taken in consultation with a the doctor there is no medicine for gall bladder stones there are many myths is there any medicine available no is there anything by which we can break or remove the stones no is stent or open tube curable for gallbladder stones no so gallbladder stones when they cause problems like pain in abdomen problem in digestion recurrent consultation for upper abdominal pain when someone has gallbladder stones or when they cause complications like acute cholecystitis empyema gangrene chronic cholecystitis cholangitis jaundice gallbladder stones are notorious to cause serious problems like empyema or pus filled gallbladder or pancreatitis which can be serious cholangitis which can be life threatening so in so when these complications occur someone will definitely require an operation for gallbladder stones but does anyone should wait till these complications happen no gallbladder stone is very common problem in india especially in north india along the gangetic belt in states like assam bihar orissa kolkata daily up it's very common even cancer of gallbladder is very common in these states so especially patient who is coming from north india who has stone who is young so i would still advise operation because someone has 30 40 50 years of life to go so rather than experiencing serious complication it's always better to get operated when someone is in fit and good health which will be beneficial because gallbladder stones are not going to disappear by any kind of medicine or anything gallbladder stone formation is a metabolic problem there are multifactorial things which are involved in formation of gallbladder so there is no one single thing which is important for formation of gallbladder stones or by which someone can be protected so my suggestion is when someone has gallbladder stones he has to consult he should not ignore otherwise someone can land up in big serious problem because i do see so many cases where patients in spite of knowing just ignore and they come in emergency with serious problems like acute pancreatitis cholangitis empyema and gangrene of gallbladder these conditions can be serious and life threatening so i am not advising everyone to undergo an operation but there are patients who really require help consultation and operation nowadays gallbladder stones can be treated with laparoscopic surgery which is a keyhole or minimum access surgery which can be done in day care setup or when in very short stay of hospital say couple of days when patient is young fit healthy surgery can be done very peacefully 
without any complication i won't say there is something like zero complication in any kind of surgery anywhere in the world there is always a risk with any kind of invasive procedure let it be just medicine but we have to balance the risk and benefit and then only we should take a call regarding gall bladder stones so asymptomatic gall bladder stones does not mean someone does not require anything or that is benign or not harmful even if we call as asymptomatic gall bladder stone that does not mean that is non problematic because even in asymptomatic gall bladder stones there is risk of two complication uh, 2% of complications occurring per year but this is just all statistics when the incident or that unfortunate event occurs to someone then that is 100% for him, uh, for him so this statistics is just for academic and statistical purpose rather than individual purpose so for gall bladder stones i would advise to consult doctor surgeon and take a balanced decision rather than just ignoring or listening to anyone who is asking for some simple remedy for gall bladder stones because the problem because of gall bladder stone can be really life threatening and disastrous so i hope you have understood whatever i have spoken thank you all for listening me